All right, today we're going to be testing out some new uh, spurs. We got some uh, new Elderid from uh, Arborist Boutique in. It wants us to try them out and give us a little review. And then we're going to compare them against uh, these old ones that I've been climbing with for five years or so. Okay, so now we're going to try these on and adjust them. Uh, we got the uh, left, so you know which foot to put it on. Uh, right away, I'm a little bit skeptical about having two of these straps. I think it would be better if they were like together at least, but uh, it makes it a little bit clumsier. Uh, let's try this out. I usually do mine from the top up. I guess with the having the advantage of the two straps, even though it's a bit clumsier, is that this allows for a little bit tighter fit. I'm gonna have this on the on the last uh, uh, adjustment because I have big feet, big boots. It says something here about a minimum overlap with the Velcro. Uh, I'm not getting there, so obviously I have something a bit wrong, but I'm already at the max here as well. I just got big feet, I guess. There we go. Here's my kneecap, and I got that bone in front. You just have it just below that. Mmm, yeah. fresh wood. <laughs> The angle of the spikes and stuff seem about the same as the other ones. Okay, let's test these puppies out. They bite in pretty good. Um, very comfortable. Performance wise, yeah, quite similar to uh, my old ones. Uh, yeah, they still keep um, quite tight, nothing has loosened up. Um, there is a little bit of difference in the form of the, the bottom. The other ones are a little bit rounder, so, and these are more like square. I don't know if you can see what I mean on the bottom of the boot uh, which means that uh, there is a little bit of play back and forth but not not that bad uh, and with a little bit of adjustment it feels like more on the back heel than to the side of the boot like the old ones but that could be just a matter of uh, adjusting loosening up the back and tightening more here okay the, ad the adjustment here is what we've been fooling around with a little bit because it makes a big difference if the the weight is dispersed over like it feels more towards your back heel or the middle of your foot uh, and we want it more like in the middle to do that um, I've got to loosen this up whereas before I had it I don't know if you can see this and you can see that their minimum overlap is back here uh, I don't meet that minimum so I mean that would be easily fixed with just a longer velcro piece here and in order to be able to move this forward a bit more and then this one has a better overlap as well whereas before it was back towards the minimum when this one was at the minimum so for me yeah I mean just uh, just extending this strap a bit would help a lot in being able to more uh, adjustability all right so now we adjusted the uh the spikes a bit so they're more towards the middle of the foot and we're going to test out a tree that's leaning a bit so it's going to be uh, yeah how it handles when you're forced to the side Wow. Ah. 
Yeah, so now I've uh, adjusted uh, the gaff so it's uh, everything's more in the middle side of my foot instead of uh, more towards the back heel. So the weight uh, dispersion was quite quite good this time. Uh, but in order to do that, I had to loosen this back strap uh, quite a bit so that it doesn't meet the uh, the minimum overlap that they're showing here, uh, which is easily fixed if they just made a a bit of a longer strap here. Uh, is, uh, yeah, big boots. Uh, but otherwise, yeah, very comfortable. No problem going from side to side. Yeah, I'd definitely buy them.